Hey guys, it's me, Derek. Welcome to the channel, and I'm glad you're here, because today I just wanted to chat with you guys. Talk about something that means a lot to me. It means a whole lot to me, actually. Uh, I know I've talked about it a lot before, but there's a few things I wanted to update you guys on. So, those who know me, last year I did um, have weight loss surgery. And um, since then, a year, almost a year later, which will be a year in August, uh, I've not done too well on it, uh, to be, to be honest, to be absolutely honest, I failed big time. But I'm trying to fix that, um, with some help from my doctors and my fiance. Uh, we're trying to restart the weight loss stuff because I gained almost 20 pounds. That's embarrassing. It's really embarrassing. You know, I was hyped up to get all this stuff done, but I screwed up by not following it right and going back to my old ways of eating which has also caused me to get a whole lot more depressed because you know I've done this to myself I seen what I'm doing to myself uh, and I have really bad self-esteem issues to begin with but the only person I can blame is me I'm the only person that can blame myself I'm, I'm the one that did it I'm the one that did it. I'm the one that decided to eat bad things again. I was the one that decided to go down that road how I used to be prior to the surgery. And, you know, almost a year later, I, after losing 70 pounds, I gained almost 20 of it back, which is not good. Not good at all. I don't want to go back to being that big again because there was a lot of health problems, health risks, diabetes, high blood pressure. Uh, and I almost had all that stuff regulated. I haven't had to take insulin for a long time, which is good because I don't want to. I don't want to do that again. I, I don't want to be poking myself and prodding myself with needles. But I'm trying really hard, and I keep on fucking up. And I'm hoping get some words of encouragement from you guys. I don't want you to feel sorry for me, but you know. A few uh, kind words would be awesome. A little bit of cheerleading in the background. I'm definitely going to be pushing. I've got people in my family. I got my fiance. I got my friends. They're pushing for me. Uh, so I'm hoping I can turn this boat around. That way I can be more healthier for not only just me, but for everyone around me, including my channel. Because in the future, I don't want you guys to see me back to my old weight way more depressed than I am now which that's been a problem lately I'm just going to go ahead and tell you now it's been a problem um, my depression's been really bad uh, I've got severe bipolar depression I know what you're thinking another fat neck beard that is mental issues yeah I admit it I am one of those guys I fit that stereotype very nicely previously I used to be a simp I'm pretty sure we all been that way. It's what, at least I acknowledge the fact that I used to be a simp. But, you know, I, I was really happy whenever I got this done. And I slowly, like I said, I started eating the bad stuff again. Adding breads and pasta, pizza. And it just keeps going. Sweets, which is a big thing for me. I love sweets. But, yeah, we're trying to fix that. Um, another thing I want to talk to you about, too, since we're on the issue of the mental health, I know I've talked to you guys a lot about this, but this channel was not made just for me. I ultimately wanted this channel to be something for anybody that wanted to stop by, that shared the same issues that I have, maybe be an outlet to actually talk to somebody and be that kind of support for you guys. And I do want to do that, you know. Feel free if, you know, and if I don't answer right away, just, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll do as best I can to get back to you. Feel free to get at me on social media. But you have all my links on the actual channel. If you're watching this on, I don't know, Facebook, Twitter, you know, whatever. Or if you follow me on TikTok, you can TikTok me, I guess. TikTok me there. <laughs> but I just want you guys to know that um, if you're seriously hurting... Don't be afraid to uh, reach out. Just don't. Don't be afraid to. Because I would rather 
you reach out to somebody or than you reaching out to a final solution which you don't want trust me it's it's not fun losing somebody to suicide trust me i know i know from experience it sucks it hurts me still today and it's one of my problems you know i lost my one of my best friends suicide and i've had my calls close calls a few times and i don't want you guys to have to go through that it's not fun trust me it's not you won't like it um don't be afraid also if if you you know, if you want, reach out to a psychiatrist. If you have to check yourself in the hospital, do that. Check yourself in. It, you know, it helps. It really does. Uh, it kind of puts uh, things in perspective and you can see where, you know, there's people that's got, got a way worse off than you do. I've been in there four times. Yeah, not my proudest, not my proudest moment, but I'm glad I went instead of being six feet underground i think that's a good thing and also if you have somebody in your life like let's go ahead and put for instance my fiance monty if you have somebody in your life and you love them very much take care of that make sure that you hold that don't throw it away don't let it get away from you this you know fight for it kick ass for it you know, always do your best. Don't let them go. Because they're ultimately, that's going to be your cheerleader. It's going to be uh, your plus one, player two. I know it's kind of cheesy. And a lot of this stuff is really cheesy because I'm a cheese man. I'm a cheesy boy. I'm a cheesy boy. Which also, since we're on it, let's get a, over to a couple more things. The channel is slowly growing. I'm trying to figure out ways to get the channel to grow faster and being sent out to more people and i'm having a really hard time doing that i feel like you know i do maybe i should do a whole lot better on my videos and i know my my editing's not that great i'm not martin scorsese or anything but i want to do a whole lot better for you guys with the content and i also want to do more content I do stream uh, Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Tuesdays are now date night. That's that's designated date night. So um, so it's Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday. I'll be streaming on here as on Twitch. I'll also be making more content as Pokemon sets comes out as long as I can afford it. <laughs> Which Pokemon has been pretty expensive lately. We got Chilling Rain. And it's not been good. <laughs> Chilling rain has been terrible to us. But I want to make. I want to know what you guys want. What 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 more can I do? And how can we get this channel to keep going the way it is? You know, we, we're getting maybe a couple new followers every once in a while. Not not a lot. And to be honest, I just restarted this probably about half a year ago. I restarted going back deeper into it and it's almost like starting over from scratch it really is it's it's like starting over from scratch now i'm trying to figure out the tags i'm trying to do my descriptions my titles my thumbnails trying to make them interesting for you guys and i'm also doing things like giveaways we give away pokemon uh trading card game online codes all the time you know like two to three times a month and we also are working to reach 500 followers because once we do that, we're giving away a free copy of Pokemon Snap or Pokemon Elite Trainer Box. Depending when that is, you know, we don't know yet. But I am happy to see growth. And that's important. That's an important thing. And I'm hoping, but what I'm doing is entertaining for you. Um, and, you know, I would definitely like to know. You know, some of the games I've been streaming lately... Uh, I kind of went back to my roots from whenever I first started streaming and going back to horror, which I love horror games, don't get me wrong, we just finished up Condemned Criminal Origins, which was pretty awesome to go back to after all these years. The first time I played it was back in 2005, which that kind of shows how old I am, maybe. I'm, I'm pretty old. 1987 is old. <laughs> to me. I mean, I'm not a boomer. Or am I? Am I a boomer? Maybe. I don't know. 
But yeah, I just kind of want you guys to let me know what kind of content you want. I have got some recommendations on some games like uh, Life is Strange, Doki Doki Literature Club, um, maybe some Mario Karts, stuff like that. And I'm really interested in doing that. And I'm not sure what the next game we're going to stream. Uh, Doki Doki Literature Club has an enhanced version coming out. Life is Strange has an enhanced version coming out. So we'll probably do those when those come out. Uh, or at least whenever I can pick them up uh, on, you know, when I can. Uh, as in, I'm not, I'm not breaking in the cash right now at all. It's just, you know, so you gotta kind of take it as it is. But, yeah, I just want to know what you guys think I should do for you guys to make it a whole lot better for you. I, I, I just do. And this week coming up, hopefully... We'll have our uh, binder reveal, which I'm really excited about. It's finally finished. We're start, starting on our third uh, Ultra Rares binder, and I'm pretty excited to see what happens with that one. Uh, we do have a few binders full of just regular holographics and reverse hollows, but we don't really want to look at those. We want to look at all the uh, Ultra Rares of Vintage and stuff like that, so uh, we'll get to see that hopefully soon. Uh, we got more Pokemon sets coming out this year. Uh, 25th anniversary is coming up, which is already here. It's just a matter of time before Nintendo and the Pokemon company is like, hey, guess what? You can go ahead and pre-order your Pokemon 25th anniversary sets. Uh, we're also trying to find that special delivery Charizard. And I thought we was going to get it with uh, the error boxes that the Pokemon Center sent us, but they are making good with that. But was hoping to get the special delivery Charizard, but that didn't happen didn't happen and maybe it was wishful thinking i don't know a lot of people thought that was going to happen because this was the first time that the pokemon center had their own exclusive uh etb which was supposed to have 10 packs but they was manufactured wrong and only have eight packs so they're fixing that hopefully hopefully they'll let us know when we can get our hands on special delivery charizard because i definitely want to do that uh, I also want to do some more stuff about like movie reviews, um, more game reviews, uh, do some skits, stuff like that, talk a little bit about music. Uh, I, I have a lot of ideas that I want to do for this channel, um, and I want to try to get more content out to you guys, maybe at least two to three videos a week, not including my streams. I want to try to do that for you guys. I want this to be an interesting channel. I want you guys to have a nice place to be, and I'd like to see our community grow because this isn't just for me. This is for you guys. You guys are ultimately in, guitar, in control of how things go, and I think that's great. I also want to give a shout out to uh, one of the, our friends over in the Nerds community, uh, one of our uh, star boys, Nick. I hope you're doing good, bro. Hope you're doing good. Uh, you got handed a bad bad hand and I see that you're you know kicking ass and taking names and hopefully soon we'll get you back to where you need to be man <laughs> but other than that guys I just want to hear from you thank you so much for watching thanks for giving me a chance feel free to hit that follow button like I said we'll be doing a giveaway once we reach 500 followers and again I appreciate it also check out if you don't have if you get a chance check out the confusing words on youtube check her out she makes great content would love to eventually get her on the podcast for the pokey cast um which we need to we need to change that up a little bit it's hard to do it by myself but uh check out uh the confusing words she's awesome she does pokemon content and yeah check her out but other than that guys you guys have a great day and i'll see you soon